This week, they'll look like an idiot because you are going to learn the impossible knot. Seriously, look at those fish. This episode of Scam School brought to you by Squarespace and Netflix. Go to netflix.com slash scam school for your free trial membership. Welcome to the show that makes a solemn promise never to make prequels that will break your childhood heart. Scam School, the only show dedicated to social engineering at the bar and on the street. I'm your host, Brian Brushwood, and as of today, you can now punk anyone, anytime, anywhere using the simplest of props, whether it's a necktie or a piece of rope, you are about to learn the impossible knot. Why, why are you still following me? I don't, I'm not comfortable with this. We've, we've been there before! Oh! How many you guys are badasses when it comes to high-end theoretical mathematics? Anyone? Anyone? Or, nobody? How many of you have ever heard of the concept of topology in math? How many of you guys just want me to give you a beer right now? <laughs> All right, so here's the thing, Roll right? Up. I'm going to use this rope. This is a very, very old trick, and I'm gonna do it with rope, which looks kind of cheesy and magic-y, but you can do it just as easy. You can grab somebody's tie right off their, off their neck and it'll work just as well. Although you probably don't wanna just actually grab their tie right off their neck, that'll be weird. But the idea is, is you guys, in fact, everybody here, grab, set down your drinks, everybody grab a rope. So if you hold it, you'll notice that as long as you're holding onto the rope, there's a closed loop all the way around, right? Mm -hmm. And there's no way to make an overhand knot. Now, normally an overhand knot is one of these, right? There's no way to make an overhand knot without letting go of the rope at some point. You guys learn that? In fact, go ahead and try. Let me see. <laughs> You're like, Brian, you just told me there's no way, there's no way to do it. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> now, when I was in elementary school, they mentioned this one. What you could do is you can start with your arms crossed and grab one arm and grab the other, and then you can do this thing, right? But that's, that's, that's cheesy and, and cheating. What I'm gonna teach you guys is that there's a way to create a knot that looks exactly like an overhand knot. Remember, that's an overhand knot. It looks exactly like it, but you never let go of the rope. All you do, it looks just like an overhand knot, but you can't make an overhand knot without actually letting go. So it's a simulation of it. So that's what we're gonna learn. You guys ready? Let's do it. Squarespace offers users a flexible solution for anyone looking to create a blog, personal portfolio, or any kind of website. It don't matter what level of coding experience you have, because Squarespace can provide the tools needed to create a high-end, complex, badass website that's uniquely your own. Don't worry if you come across any questions or issues. Get this, Squarespace offers every user 24-7 support the human. Squarespace just pushed a brand new social widget for geolocation services. You can display all your check-ins from your four squares and your goalas, your Facebook places, and they all show up on a live Google map. Squarespace is the only web publishing platform with a native built-in solution for displaying your check-in data. The widget is totally customizable, fully integrated with the Squarespace style editor. Squarespace's iPhone app lets you publish your blog while you're on the go at the bar, at the other bar, at the fourth bar, and you can moderate all your comments section as well. You get push notifications to approve new comments, mark existing comments as spam, you can reply to comments and more all from your iPhone. Many of the internet's highest traffic web pages are powered by Squarespace, not to mention many of the personal pages of Rev3 hosts and personalities. So go to www.squarespace.com slash scam school and get your two week free trial to learn more. First thing you're gonna do is you're gonna make a backwards J. Backwards J, backwards J. There you go, you guys got it. You're gonna drape it down and you'll notice there are two holes, one on the left, one on the right. You're gonna take your right hand, you're gonna go out the left and then back through the right. <laughs> really? There you go. There you go, and then, and then you're gonna pull back, right? And you toss it forward and you'll get a knot. I can't get it over my bling, hold on. Oh, I did not do that. All right, epic fail all the way across the board. Let's try again, let's try again. All right, one more time, one more time. You're gonna you do a backwards J. You're gonna pull it down. So you got two holes, one on the left, one on the right. So there you go. There you go. You're gonna go out the left, back in the right, toss it forward, and you get a knot. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all 
come on. Dude, He's got to pay attention. He's got to do exactly what I do. One more time. Backwards J. Backwards J. Backwards J. You're going to pull it down. You got two holes. You're going to go out the left, <laughs> back to the right. Right? So you should have this. How many guys? Let me I'm see. still at Jake. I got that. All right, you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. Yeah, well, well, here, look, look, he's got it. Here, watch, watch. You've already done it. Here, just pull your hands out. Pull your hands out. And you see, so you already have it done, right? What the hell? Yeah, so, okay, here, try again. You guys got it, you guys got it. Here, one more time. You do the backwards J. Do the backwards J. You pull it down. Go around the right. You wrist. go out the left. You go in the right. Toss it forward. <laughs> Skibbity bop. <laughs> And there it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what is are, you, are you pissed off <laughs> yet? <laughs> um, I was pissed two tries ago. <laughs> Here, do, do it right along with me. Move for move. Backwards J. Backwards J. That's, that's an actual J. There you go. Got it. You're going to pull it down. You're going to go out the left. Going You're going to go back to the right. All right, now we've done everything the same, right? You just toss it over, and you get a nut. That's where you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> All right, are you pissed off enough that you want to know what you're missing out on? Yes. Okay, but the most important question is, will you pay me one single drink for the answer? <laughs> you cheap mother... <laughs> I've been working five months, man. <laughs> now, we'll give you the answer for free then, my friends, but first, got to thank our sponsors. Give me a know Netflix is the world's largest subscription service, instantly streaming TV episodes and movies over the internet and sending DVDs by the mail. Members can select from a growing library of titles that can be watched instantly and a vast array of titles on DVD. Among the large and expanding number of devices, you can watch them on the Xbox 360, Sony's PS3, the Nintendo Wii, find movies you love easily, don't forget your computer dude, I watch half of mine on my computer. As a Netflix Unlimited member, you get DVDs by mail in about one business day. You watch as many movies as you want. Shipping's always free, never any late fees or due dates. As a new member and Scam School viewer, you can get a free trial membership. Head on over to Netflix.com slash Scam School. Sign up now. You got to use this URL. It's the only way they know. It's my free beers getting tricks that are keeping them in business. What I love about this gag is that it's something so fair that you can take all night, and I have spent hours teaching someone over and over and over again how to do it, and they were never able to pull it off. And the answer is, is because I am a liar and a cheat, which is probably no surprise to anyone who watches Scam School. 90% of the trick is exactly the way I explain it. You really do start with it, with one in each hand. You really do make a backwards J. You really do pull it down, so you have two holes. You really do go out the left, you really do come back through the right, and you really do end up right here. So at this point, we have done everything exactly the same. Now comes the big fat lie, where what I tell you I'm doing is I'm just throwing my hands forward. What I'm actually doing is you'll notice on my right hand, I have this positioned where it's going in and around this rope. As I make the big motion of tossing my hands forward, with my right hand, I'm pinching this here and letting go with my thumb. So it actually slips through. Magicians call this the big move covering the little move. So that happens while you're watching and I toss it forward and you end up with an overhand knot. So again, I, st stay where you guys are. Stay where, or, or just screw it up, Hondo, that's fine. <laughs> so again, you're gonna do backwards J. <laughs> you pull it over, you go out the left, you go in the right, and you wanna make sure that it's pulled, it's cheated up on your right hand. Make sure Everyone make sure it's that's cheated crazy. up on your right hand so that all your fingers will be able to pinch this. So all you gotta do is pinch with your fingers and let go with your thumb as you toss it forward. So you got, you already have it pinched, you already have it pinched, you already have it pinched, you already, uh, well, you, I don't know what the hell you're doing. That's, <laughs> I'm doing it, I'm doing my own style. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. You, you have it pinched and then you're gonna, well, you're just... gonna let go with your thumb as you toss it forward. Aha! So Nick got it, Mahondo got it. All right, gentlemen, final exam time. You guys work as a team. Anyone who pulls it off, free drink on Brian. Somebody lead the group. All right, so you're gonna pull it? Hondo's got it, Hondo's got it. All right. Oh, Hondo's got it. Nick? <laughs> Nick's got it! John's just, yeah. John, yeah. John just tied a freaking knot. That's good enough for me. Oh, you got it!
guys, I'll fold it up. Okay, a couple of things to remember on the subtleties on it. There's two things. Uh, number one, remember, you, by now you guys all have the moves, but what I find a lot of people run into is they get right here, yeah, it's, and it's way too low. It's all the way down on their wrist, on their right hand. So in that case, what, what you wanna do is when you get here, I make a moment of rotating my wrists out, and when I rotate my wrist out, this cheats up far enough that I can grab it with my right hand. And then when you're forward and you, you're <laughs> like you're throwing something forward, you're able to do the secret move and get that to toss down. Second thing, now Hondo, do you remember how I was able to show that you actually had the trick right, even though you had no idea how you were doing it? I remember you doing that. <laughs> so this is great. When, <laughs> when you've got two people, go, go ahead and reset it. One of the great things about this is, go out the left, go in the right. When you're set at this point, every time they try to throw it forward, it's not going to work. But if I say, oh no, 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 look, you've got it. And I grab these tips and tell you to pull your hands out. Remember, that is a moment where I'm actually breaking the seal. So now when you pull your hands out, even though you haven't done any secret moves, it'll look like, like you were doing something right the entire time. So you can make them feel like they did have it right and then let them fail over and over and over and over again. But uh, look, you guys were freaking amazing. That was, that was awesome. Fun. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much, dude. That was badass. Now, before you try to pull this one off, practice, practice, practice. Nothing's going to be worse than you trying to look like the scam master and ending up being punked by your own trick. Speaking of which, I want to hear about your success stories and failure stories, so hit us up at the boards at revision3.com slash scam school, where you can see all of our episodes right back to episode one. If you want to suggest your favorite bar scam, write me directly at brian at revision3.com, and if you're doing the Twitter thing, ask me a question. I respond to just about every at reply I get at twitter.com slash wood. If you want to follow the show, hit up twitter.com slash scam school, and next week, make sure to join us, because we are going to learn how you can make instant homebrew beer using muriatic acid, old stale peanut shells, and some Kool-Aid. Until then, back to the bar.